Okay, so I have a, a scene here in, in Blender, and I'm just going to do a Shift A, and I'm going to come to Mesh, and we're going to come down to Monkey here, and we're just going to add Susan into the scene. And I'm going to right click and Shade Smooth, and then I'm going to come over to the Spanner, the Modifier tab, and I'm going to add uh, from Generate a Subdivision Surface Modifier, and I'm going to give it an extra level. Of division like that uh, and what I want to do now is I want to build a cage for Susan and I have one that I prepared earlier which is simply a cube that has been modeled to fit uh, fit Susan uh, you could if you wanted to deform the head you could use a lattice uh, which is generally a box shape, but if you want something a little bit more detailed or have a have a, a, a better fitted cage, then we want to use uh, instead of the lattice modifier, we want to use the mesh deform, which allows to build a custom cage. So if I select Susan again and come over to the modifier tab and add from deform a mesh deform modifier. Uh, we can now from the rollout object here we can select our cage like so and then we immediately want to bind the cage to Susan. Uh, now if I click on the cage and press tab to get into edit mode I should be able to just select verts from the cage and it'll start to deform Susan like so. Um, but let's make uh, let's make things a little bit more interesting. And if I select on Susan, press Tab to go into the edit mode. If I just deselect everything, I press three to get faces, and I'm going to select a face from her eye, and press L to get the linked. So we've got both eyes selected now and we are going to come to the data tab down here on the right hand side of the screen and we're going to add a vertex group by pressing the plus key and I'm going to double click on the group and I'm going to call this eyes and press enter and then I'm going to assign my selection to that group. Now I'm going to do a control I to invert my selection I'm going to press the plus again double click on group, group and we call this head press enter and then assign everything to that selection uh, and now I'm just going to press tab again to come out of uh, edit mode and we'll go back up to the modifier tab and we'll notice in the mesh d4 modifier uh, we have a vertex group selection here and if I just click in that box now I can select either the eyes or the head and now if I go back to my cage and press tab if I uh, make a vert selection and stretch or deform now the eyes are not moving. But however, if I go back to the modifier, I can actually swap my selection group now. Now the eyes move and not the head.